Party leader since 2000, chancellor since 2005. For many, an ever-present, dependable leader of Europe's strongest economy. Firstly, at the CDU Party Congress in December in Hamburg, I will not put myself forward again as candidate for the CDU chair. Secondly, this fourth term is my last as German Chancellor. It grabbed the headlines, but some saw it coming. Bruising election failures led to a shaky coalition with the centre-left SPD. A decision to admit a million refugees and migrants in 2015 breathed new life into the politics of the far right and left. Ever since, traditional parties of government have seen votes slip away. Candidates to take over a CDU party know they need to rebrand. Some fear a shift to the right. We cannot accept that on the left and right margins of our democracy, parties which seek to divide take root in both state parliaments and in the Bundestag as well. We cannot accept voters being seduced by populist parties out of frustration with established parties. She plans to remain chancellor until 2021, but she may be forced out sooner. The Merkel era has seen remarkable economic prosperity. Germany led Europe's response to the financial crisis. Unpopular with Greeks, Italians and others for sure, but popular at home. Her cautious diplomatic approach frustrated some, but many still look to her for leadership over Russian actions in Ukraine, Brexit and Europe's response to the destabilization of the Trump presidency. She had to face many challenges, the migrant crisis as well as the financial crisis. She never forgot what values Europe stood for and she led and is leading her country with much courage. While her departure may attract new leaders onto the stage, there is fear for Germany's future and its role as Europe's leading power. Its post-war success was built on stable government from the centre. Its politics and diplomacy were shaped by its difficult 20th century legacy of two world wars. It invested wholeheartedly in multilateralism and rules-based globalization. Merkel's withdrawal comes at a time when the forces of polarization and unilateralism are gaining ground. As she prepares to go, the fear is Germany could turn in on itself, and its well-known moderation could go as well. Simon McGregor would TRT World.